hi guys today we're going to be doing what's the next big change for you coming in 10 days so you guys like this video a lot so i'm going to be doing another one of these so what i want you to do is to choose group number one number two number three or number four and let's get right on started so let's start with group number one hello group number one so today we have the black onyx i think this one is pretty sure a lot of the black ones look really really similar but i'm pretty sure this is black onyx so let's go into your reading and see what's coming forward for you i'm feeling a lot of forward movement for you guys by the way so just letting you know like a lot of forcing movement not the fact that you're actually forcing anything but the movement is actually moving now it's not actually just it's not still yes momentum that's exactly what i was feeling so in the tarot we have the judgment and for the clarifiers, we have the Two of Wands and a Page of Cups. So in a sense, you probably will be having some sort of judgment um, to do with a certain Pisces. Could also be to do with a fire or an air sign. Somebody who is going through quite an intense soul healing journey, or you are going through an intense soul healing journey, where you possibly are discovering your inner child and how to deal with those emotions because you'll be you've been self-reliant for a long time i feel like a lot of you who are single watching this um have been single for quite a long time and you've been working on yourself you've possibly been watching tarot card readings you've possibly got private readings before that sort of thing you could even just be like you could like oracle cards you could buy yourself a deck that sort of thing if not i just feel like you have been working on yourself a lot and you've been healing yourself through some soul a soul healing journey so i see something coming in really really strongly to do with a new person i feel like they've come from a really far away place or like a different country or they've just moved to where you are i definitely feel like you could also be the other way around where you could move to somewhere and they could be there and then you basically could be getting together i feel like some sort of connection is coming towards each other i'm seeing like two people and they're slowly moving towards each other and they're meeting in the middle so if you're possibly waiting to to like to what am i saying you're possibly waiting to meet a friend from abroad uh possibly waiting to um get some sort of clarity on a certain situation to do the friend family member partner that sort of thing i feel like this will come from 10 days of watching this video obviously it's not a guarantee but i feel like this is going to be like okay i thought about what i want to say and now i'm going to offer you this cut i feel like this could be the other person or this could be you i feel like pretty much i feel like it's the other person because i feel like they've decided this is what i want and i'm going to come towards you in person for watching this video so yeah i feel like that's literally it i think like the energy that you are just like looking into i feel like it's gaining momentum i feel like you're gaining momentum in your life and because you are working on yourself and your inner child it's like the universe is recognizing this and they're like hell yeah let's give you a big big offering okay and i feel like this offering is really really good a lot of people don't like the page of cups but i love the page of cups i think he's really cute so i can see someone definitely coming towards you um who's younger than you or just could just be like a new energy where you just feel really really comfortable this is somebody who is like pro probably your soul family most likely and I definitely feel like because since you've been doing yoga or you might need to just start doing yoga, you may start doing yoga 10 days from this video. And I definitely feel like there's just some connection with the Oracle cards. I definitely feel like somebody could be, have told you something, possibly have told you to do yoga, which is ironic because I'm literally telling you that now. <laughs> but yeah, I definitely feel like this is going to come in really strongly. Um, I definitely feel like the soul healing is connected to your inner child and it's just coming through really strongly. This person they're showing me is like a present. So because you've been working so hard, it's almost like a little gift that you're going to be given in the form of a person, okay? And they're really, really connected with you, that you have a lot in common with this person. And it could be a friend, family member, lover, that sort of thing. But I definitely feel like more on your age, you're at the same age as you. So I'm not really feeling like a, like a, like a long last sister or something, unless they're the same age as you. I'm feeling somebody who is possibly um, just on your wavelength, I feel like. I mean, it could be someone different age. <clears throat> but i'm actually seeing just someone who's on the same level as you so it could even be a different age i'm just seeing somebody who you are really going to connect with um and it's just going to be a really nice offer coming through a strong offer of commitment or just abundance generally um and something really lovely so thank you for watching guys if you'd like to get a private reading with me all my readings are linked uh, are 
down below in the description box they're all written down so you can just kind of choose which one you would like if not feel free to comment down below if it resonated if it didn't then just let it fly thank you so much for being here i appreciate you so 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 much feel free to subscribe down below also if you'd like to like this video i'd love that so much and i'll speak to you very soon bye Hello group number two, thank you so much for clicking on this video, thank you so much for being here. Today we have the rose quartz, lovely. So let's see what's going on for you in the next 10 days. So we have self love, amazing. We have the rose quartz, <clears throat> excuse me, sorry about that. <laughs> we have the rose quartz and self love and that's pretty much what that is, so that's, that's amazing. We have cleanse, environmentalist, vacation. <clears throat> sorry guys, my throat. <coughs> Where are you going for it? Uh, be honest with yourself. Parenting and children. And prosperity lies ahead. Okay, so I'm not sure if this is connected to you guys. But my chest and my lungs are suddenly like kind of <coughs> chocking up a little bit. So I don't know if you guys are, I don't know, starting smoking or something. Or you guys have got a lot of emotion stuck in your throat and your chest. And you're not letting it go. That's what I'm feeling. I feel like you need to get out more. And the next 10 days, I feel like especially is going to be really good for you to go out because I feel like that's going to be really good for your mental health. It's going to help you to cleanse. And in terms of self-love, um, I feel like I need to get a tarot card and a self-love card because I feel like it's something that needs to be said, which I'm not sure what it is. Page of Wands. Yes. Okay. So we had 10 of Cups underneath. So I feel like the fact that you will be um, looking more into your self-love and just working on yourself in general, I feel like it's going to lead you into really nice places. And I feel like you're actually going to meet someone new, which would be really, really lovely. Um, I feel like you could meet someone travelling. If you want to travel, we have the vacation card here. So I feel like they're telling me basically to be honest with yourself as to if you want to travel to meet someone. Or if you want to, if someone might be honest with you, if they want to travel and meet you. Or you could just want to go on holiday <clears throat> and meet someone abroad or just generally just go on holiday and have a good time. So we have parenting and children. So there may be an issue that's um, wanted to be resolved to do with parenting and children. Um, you could want children. Um, you could want to start caring for children, um, be a teacher, that sort of thing. Um, I'm also seeing a happily ever after card. So I'm feeling like you could actually meet someone you're gonna have, to have kids with. And it's not gonna be a surprise. <clears throat> Excuse me, I feel like you're actually probably gonna decide that you want to have children with this person. But it could also mean that you meet someone who is a potential partner to have children with, okay? Um, this could be a Taurus, but obviously it doesn't have to be. Um, I feel like this person who you are connecting with is very headstrong. Obviously, if you're not connecting with anybody um, or this doesn't resonate, then you just will have prosperity, which is lying ahead. I feel like this is to do with the Page of Wands. Prosper prosperity is coming through really, really strongly. And I feel like the more you cleanse yourself and go outside to cleanse it will help so much easier for everything to flow and so i keep burping but it is a good thing i seem to burp a lot in readings at the moment but it is a good thing okay so for the tarot we have the high priestess and uh to clarify we had justice two very very strong figures this is that energy is what i was feeling with the taurus card it's like really really strong energy that's properly grounded and you're deciding what you really want and i feel like if you are connecting with somebody who's almost trying to figure out you or you're trying to figure out them i feel like you're going to decide both equally that you both want each other which is so nice i just feel like there's a lot of wholehearted energy here where you both are on the same level and i feel like this could be um a very spiritual connection obviously if it doesn't if this isn't anybody i feel like this is you and this is somebody who's gonna give you an offer of some sort that's gonna be very very long term and it's going to be something where you're going to get a lot of coin i'm getting this a lot of coin okay so i really hope this resonated with you guys before i go actually i'm going to pull you one more card because i just feel the need to so what else does group number two need to know oh my god okay stand your ground family harmony right okay so i definitely feel like it could be some sort of issue to do with somebody who you need to stand your ground with um there could be like a family member that you need to stand your ground with and just be like, right, I want this to happen. And I feel like it's going to happen. I feel like this sounds really intense. But I feel like a family member could have passed away. This is the past tense. This is not a future prediction. Just letting you know. I feel like a family member could have passed away. And you and somebody else are trying to get uh, custody of a certain thing. So it could be a certain house. It could be um, amount, a certain amount of money. It could be uh, items. 
heirlooms, that sort of thing. And I feel like that is going to be like, you need to stand your ground in this situation. And this also could be even custody of a child, which is very intense, but here it is. <laughs> so uh, that's what I'm seeing for you guys. Yeah. Um, I feel like it's also possibly if you're a new parent, it's learning to stand your ground. And uh, yeah, obviously it doesn't resonate for everybody. That was a very specific answer. Um, but yeah, so thank you so much for watching. If you would like to uh, purchase a private reading, all the information is on the screen here and all my personal readings are linked down below, all of the ones that I offer. Also, if you'd like to subscribe, the red button is down below. Thank you very, very much for being here. Also, if you would like to comment down below if this resonated, if it didn't resonate, just let it fly. Thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye. Hello, group number three. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Let's see what's coming for you in the next 10 days. So we have peace, music, sexuality, make, make music, kick up your heels, a time to give rather than take, fluorite, spirit guides, <clears throat> and tiger's eye, animals, solar plexus. Whoa, okay. So the funny thing is, is underneath the crystal deck, we actually had the third eye chakra. So there's definitely something going on with your third eye. My third eye has actually been pulsing a lot recently. So I feel like you guys are going to be feeling that also, possibly getting headaches. Um, not anything severe, I just feel like maybe you could feel like a little kink in like your neck or like the back of your neck or possibly your forehead. You could just feel a little something might just be off and then it will just go. And that will basically mean your third eye is possibly going to just be igniting and kind of, not reigniting, but you know what I mean? Like kind of, it's going to be more, it's going to be strong, okay? So, I feel like you guys are focusing on the relationship between giving and taking in relationships. And you're learning to sing your own song and to focus on yourself and to think, what do I actually want? And what is this serving me from this situation, okay? I feel like you guys need to have more fun. And in the next 10 days, I can see you guys working on your sexuality and the way you approach relationships in any term. It could be friendships, um, lovers, relationships, uh, like romantic relationships and family. And I feel like you're going to get quite a lot of downloads to do with your family and your connections to do with the higher realm because this this card is absolutely gorgeous like i can see such high potential with this card and i feel like with music this could be a really good way of manifesting what you want to bring in and also just to listen to music to make your vibration higher because i feel like you need to have more fun and possibly go out dancing if that's a possibility and just to yeah to have more fun i feel like you need to listen to more music that makes you feel really good because I feel like just life can get really, really intense sometimes. And I feel like people forget how uplifting music is. I definitely forget that for sure. So from the tarot, we we'll also have peace. So I definitely feel like music can, can bring you peace in the next 10 days. So we have the chariot. And we also have the seven of swords. To clarify this, we have the three of pentacles, two of wands, the eight of pentacles. And we also have death. Wow, there's a lot. Okay, right, let me have a little think into this. So I feel like you guys are really going to be working hard on your coin. And you're going to be really prosperous. I feel like a lot of you could be quitting your job. Or you could be made redundant. This isn't the future of prediction though in that sense like I'm not predicting you're going to get redundant I feel like because you I feel like you could generally think that you're going to get redundant and you possibly could be it's not in the sense that I'm predicting that you're going to get redundant because I feel like you will already know while watching this video or you just want to have a change I feel like you're fed up with all the gossip possibly in your career or you're fed up of people being toxic and I feel like you're going to move away from that sort of energy because it's going to be no longer in your life and you're moving away and I feel like this will help you work on your sexuality and as I say, how you approach relationships. And this is really big, guys. Like, you guys are going to be mo making some moves. Like, some really big moves. And I feel like you guys could definitely gonna be moving towards something that's much more prosperous. And I feel like you're going to be moving towards your soul family. And if it's not, like, a proper intense soul family, it's going to be some really lovely people who's going to serve you in a financial state. Can even be, like, a business partner. And I feel like you could be travelling to meet these people or they could be from a different country. But I definitely feel like there's a lot to do with work here. 
and you're learning how much to give within your workspace and your career. Um, obviously this will resonate, this is quite a specific reading, but I definitely feel like you guys are really going to be working on your craft, whatever that is to you. And I feel like you're going to be reaching a lot of people around the world, whatever that whatever that means to you as well. And I feel like it can be very influential in the next 10 days as well. You're going to be very influential to a lot of people. And they're telling me to um, tell people your personal experiences because I feel like it's going to be very influential to people and it's going to help a lot of people. So if you've gone through a struggle and you feel the need to kind of express that to people, I feel like possibly make like an Instagram story or tell people in person, have a conversation where you're like, look, I've gone through a lot of stuff. Maybe I can help you in this certain situation if somebody needs help. Or just maybe make like a, I don't know, a YouTube video where you talk about your problems and it, it just kind of comes out. I just feel like there's going to be a lot of influential energy, which is going to be serve like the collective and just going to serve a lot of people. And I definitely feel like that's with this moon in Virgo is it's just going to be really beneficial. And I definitely feel like the more you give to people, the more you're going to receive. And I just generally feel like that's just good karma anyway. But I definitely feel like it's just going to be really, really good for you to um just keep expressing love and if you feel like you don't really have a lot of love to give then just do it gently like love yourself and to express yourself properly in a way that's just very healthy for you just get everything out and when you obviously when it's the right time but i definitely feel like there's some sort of something going on in your solar plexus where it's got a little bit of anxiety possibly and i feel like there could just be a time when you're actually going to properly tell someone how you feel or tell someone how you feel about a certain situations so like it's going to be resolved okay as well you guys have got a lot but i hope that makes sense obviously it doesn't resonate then just let it fly or pick another group so thank you so much for watching if you'd like to get a private reading all the information is in the description below i have all my private readings listed and if you would like to connect with me on email or instagram feel free uh, uh subscribe to my channel like this video comment down below if it resonated obviously if it doesn't resonate let it fly or choose another group so thank you so much for watching and i'll speak to you very soon bye hello group number four thank you so much for clicking on this video let's see what is coming for you in the next 10 days so let's have a look so we have emotions protection they wanted to be so that's in reverse okay that's fine let's move that over a little bit uh, protection, travel, light and love. You guys have got a lot of cards, so just bear with me a second. <laughs> Feeling safe, miracle healing, quiet time, making new friends, moving forward fearlessly, bring love into the situation, adjustments are required, and a few shite, healing, heart chakra. Okie dokie. Right, I'm going to put this little one there. If you'll stay there. So... Definitely a lot of this is to do with your heart chakra. I feel like you guys feel a little bit unsafe. But just to let you know that it's it's good for you to have quiet time in this situation. And um, what's coming towards you in the next 10 days is I feel like you will want to travel. Or you will travel. I feel like you'll make new friends and you're, you're going to be making moves. They're telling me you're going to be moving forward. So I definitely feel like there's some sort of situation that needs a little bit more love. This could be to do with friendships, could be a certain person. But I feel like it's more to do with loving yourself and just to know that everything's going to be okay. And I feel like you guys are feeling a lot of emotions. Could be to do with this Cancerian moon that's, that's coming up. Like, I feel like a lot of you are really feeling it. And just to let you know that you are moving forward fearlessly. And this moon is, is, give, is bringing you guys a lot of movement and forward momentum. Just, you guys are going through quite a big healing stage. So just remember to give yourself light and love. And to just know that Fuchsia is going to be really good for you around this time so a green crystal or rose quartz anything to do with love is just very very good for you and i just generally feel like you should do things that you love if it's travel if it's doing a hobby if it's just giving yourself that boost of love and give yourself almost permission to do something you really really love even if it's probably maybe too expensive or oh i can't afford that that sort of thing i feel like just maybe possibly borrow the money from somewhere or just do what feels right to you to kind of give yourself a little kick because I feel like you need that right now because I feel like a lot of you are feeling a little bit unsafe. Um, just give yourself some quiet time and meditate or just relax. Do like watch a silly video or like do some drawing. Just anything that makes you feel really good and just like you're pampering yourself even if it's like taking photographs of nature, you know, anything that you really enjoy. I feel like bring that out because I definitely feel like you probably have been lacking self-love or just not lacking self-love because that sounds really patronizing but like lacking the time towards yourself okay 
that's definitely what I'm feeling for you guys. But it feels really, really positive because I feel like just life has just bogged you down, I feel like, in this group. But I feel like a lot of stuff is going to come through really, really nicely in the next 10 days. Like, I feel like your heart chakra is going to be healed. Or you're healing your heart chakra. And I definitely feel like someone's going to come towards you who's going to really light up your heart. Um, possibly could be after these 10 days. But there's somebody who's really going to light up your heart very, very soon, I'm seeing. And they could be travelling towards you. Or they could be someone who's far away. Or they could just be someone who's well-travelled. I'm seeing an earth sign very strongly through here. Um, also uh, Aries and Sag as well. Uh, definitely maybe Capricorn. And water signs. I'm seeing Cancerian. Pisces. Okay, that's it. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. If this doesn't resonate, then just let it fly or choose another group. This was very specific. Oh, before I go, I forgot to give you the tarot. I am a silly one. I put this on the floor and I forgot. So we have the world card. And to clarify, we have the Knight, uh, King of Pentacles and the Two of pentacles so as said definitely to do the earth sign coming through or there could just be some like earthy energy where you feel that you need to be more grounded um or you're just too grounded and you're like i need to have more fun but there's definitely someone coming towards you i say this is to do with travel so i definitely feel like someone's going to come towards you i feel like they're needing to balance themselves as well as you are um i feel like you could have a kind of unhealthy stability to do with love and relationships love and relationships not that okay maybe that but um, I meant to say money relationships. You could not have an unhealthy balance. That sounds patronising. But <laughs> patronising seems to be the word. Um, but I feel like you need to kind of balance out how much commitment you give to your career and how much you give to love and relationships. And kind of just balancing that out and just knowing that all the love that you deserve is all in inside of you. And it's just giving yourself that time. And also, if you're if you're around people who don't serve you, and don't appreciate you, then you need to let that shit go, obviously, if you can. Um, but yeah, I definitely feel like you guys are going to be quite prosperous within money as well. You could meet somebody who can help you with finances, but I definitely feel like you are just balancing um, your pentacles as well and just trying to figure out, okay, how do I afford this? But there's definitely some sort of travel um, in some sort of area, possibly, I say, someone going towards you, you going towards them, or you just wanted to travel and just thinking, actually, I need a new start. And I feel like it's definitely a new start as well. So thank you so much for watching. Um, as I said, please comment down below if it resonated. If it didn't, let it fly. Um, private readings information is in the description below. I have all of them listed down below so you can just choose whatever one you want. Please connect with me on email or Instagram. That would be lovely. And please subscribe to my channel. The red button is down below and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye guys.